Nancy? Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm great, thank you. I love the film and I cried way before I anticipated. So spoiler alert, oh. you can cry. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, but not really. <laughs> I'll take that. So what, <laughs> can you share that moment when you realized you wanted to write this memoir and celebrate your partner's life? Uh, it was a process, you know, more than an, an, a moment. But, um, you know, when the opportunity, because it was an opportunity that was brought to me uh, to tell this story, it wasn't something that I initiated. Uh, I, I thought about it, you know, and I thought, first off, can I do it? Can I do the story justice? Can I do Kit justice? Um, and, and I wasn't sure, and, you know, and that, and that insecurity plagued me throughout the writing process because he was such an in incredibly unique person. Um, but ultimately, when I, I decided I, I wanted to do it because I, I felt like there was a story here to tell. Like, I felt like I just lived through a, a unique experience. Um, and, uh, uh, and the fact that I'm being presented with an opportunity to share that with the world, I, I can't pass it up. You're pretty much stripping and sharing your 13 year relationship and now watching on screen. Which face did you enjoy watching the most on screen? Like which scene? Like yes, because there were some really happy, humbling moments that you shared. I mean, the Smurfs reveal scene is just joyous to me, even as, as emotionally fraught as it was in real life and as it is in the movie, um, there's there's just a, a, it's fun. It's just a really fun, um, joyous scene. Um, I think the, the wedding too was a really special moment to be, you know, to witness on set and also just to watch unfold in the movie because it, it's, you know, it's so indicative of the bond that I shared with my husband and, and, and there's just so much love there. I was going to ask you about the Smurfs because, I mean, obviously Smurfs have been part of our childhood. I was a fan of the Smurfs. So can you talk about you being a fan of the Smurfs and how all that was we saw on screen was true? Yeah, so that was my collection that you saw on screen. Not, so not only was it true, but that it, those that collection was authentically mine. Um, so it, it, it's as real as can be. Um, you know, and, and the movie gets into it a little bit. I think for, for me, the draw of the Smurfs is it just, it's, a, it's the nostalgia. It's, it takes me back to just a, um, an, an, an easier time, even though my childhood wasn't necessarily easier, it was simpler in many ways. Um, and also, uh, you know, reminds me of my mom, you know, who, who I lost and, and she was a, a big part of my, my Smurf hunting and Smurf procurement and, um, and seeing the Smurfs and seeing my collection is a beautiful reminder of our relationship. Well, let me share real quick. I don't know if you could see it, but there's me and my Smurf when I was a oh, kid. Oh, I think I can see it. Yes. yes. So yes, that tells you how much of a fan I was of the Smurfs myself. So thank you for bringing- Not as big of a fan as me though. Not that it's a competition. <laughs> Oh, no, I, I know. Like, I wish I knew where my Smurf is. <laughs> yeah. Nice talking to you. But thank you for bringing some of my childhood, too. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye.